but how would you revive a city like Stoke? How do you take existing industries, old skills, the 200-year legacy of industrial capitalism and do something new? At Emma Bridgewater, they've decided to have a go. An 18th century potter would recognise more or less every process in this factory. We're really good at design in this country, really fantastically good. And I feel really, really passionately that somehow we've got to renew the connection between design and industry, and that if we could do that, all sorts of really magic things could happen, and, and quickly, and change the way this country feels, because making things is great, it's so exciting. Emma Bridgewater has refused to automate or move the workforce offshore. She thinks a new generation of entrepreneurs has to get their head around employing actual people here in the UK. I think that one of the things people are frightened of is what's it like employing 180 people? Wouldn't it be better if they were in a call centre in Indonesia? The role of finance. As a family business, this sits outside the dominant finance system. If the private equity guys got hold of it, or even your pension fund, they'd have most of the production sent to the Far East pretty sharpish. For two decades, the finance sector dominated